Welcome back to Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. So while we're waiting for the legacy update, I got something really strange in the mail. It was a manila folder. You know, those like classic style folders. On the folder, it said, put the files in the computer. And in the manila folder was an old VHS tape and it said tabs mod. So uh, I got, it's a classic USB to VHS tape in a manila folder adapter. And so I was able to put the files in the computer pretty easily. It's like a, it's like a weird vacuum. It's, it's interesting. So I put the files in the computer and this is what I got. Yeah, it, isn't this kind of weird? Like imagine that this thing was mailed to me in a VHS tape in a manila folder and I put it in my computer. It's, it's probably not good, but it, it looks very strange, but it says bedtime serum. And I'm, I'm trying to figure out why I would need, he looks like a plastic surgeon with a bedtime serum. So maybe he's not a plastic surgeon. Maybe he's like, you know, the, the, the type of doctors that put you to sleep, right? So let's see his name. Oh God. Secure, contain, oh no, protect. Level four, giving the key card to personnel with an insufficient security clearance is strictly forbidden. And he's even got two blue pins and it's called a thermostat, right? The thermostat is the thing that you listen to the, the rhythms of people's hearts, right? So is this Dr. Sleep? Look, he's even got Crocs on. I mean, goodness gracious. And his bedtime serum is spraying everywhere. Sir, that is inappropriate. And I mean, I don't understand. Stand. Why do I need these? The the manila folder said put the files in the computer. You're gonna need it. Why will I need an SCP doctor with a lasso or an SCP doctor with bedtime serum? Like there's no logical explanation. Wait a second. The lasso would be used to secure uh the bedtime serum would be used to contain it what do we what would i need that for to make things even stranger i've been seeing these guys running around the temple looking when i when i ask them they just say that they're looking for it and i i say what is it and then they redact themselves and I, I don't even know what that word means except i do because wikipedia says it's a giant south american tortoise but so we have these strange soldiers running around and Dr. Sleep with a syringe. It just doesn't make any sense. There's no logical explanation that I want to entertain out there. But obviously curiosity is gonna get the better of me and I wanna see what exactly happens and obviously we're gonna use hobbits as the test subjects, which almost seem like little short people, furry footed piranhas because they jump at you and try to bite you. So I wanna see what a bedtime serum does. If he can poke him, it looks like his arms held behind his back. Maybe we need to try this with a few more doctors and bigger test subjects to see if they can actually... Oh, whoa, 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 hold on. Are they syringing each other by accident? Wait a second. They're all... <laughs> They're putting it them to sleep. Look at that. Okay, I'm pretty sure he's not been syringed. I can't tell. His eyes are open. Okay, so I was looking at this guy. This guy, I think, took the needle and it must have punctured a major artery and peanut butter and jelly were spewing out everywhere. But these serums actually put tabs units to bed, even even some of their own doctors. I'm not sure if if it's just the spraying that does it. If the serum itself is called bedtime serum and it's spewing out everywhere. So I think when they hit each other, they're able to put each other out. Uh. Yeah, so it works. The bedtime serum, uh, it's the triple Z flavor variety. You, you can find it at your nearest bedtime serum dealer near you, which I wouldn't recommend it. I think that's called street pharmacy and it's illegal. Well, next up in the weird things that I put in my computer uh, is this lasso guy, right? And he's got, he's securing? the halfling by using a lasso. Okay, yeah, so clearly, wait a minute. Maybe what we need is to lasso him and we, that's what we need, okay. So the lasso and the bedtime serum can work in concert with each other. Man, these these are pretty good procedures. Well, they're supposed to be. You missed. These should be pretty good procedures to secure and contain. 
Oh, come on, man. Yes, there we go. Okay, you tripped your friend. Now, now knock him out with the serum. But watch out for the other doctor. But clearly, they're supposed to be good together. These poor hobbits. Why are they always test subjects? We don't have any, like, mice or chickens, I guess. Tab's the equivalent would be chickens for scientific experimentation. And then we have these guys, which... To me, they just kind of look like, you know, they have the modern digital camouflage. Uh, they got a combat knife, which they, they must have lost it. But they have some pretty impressive Fabrique Nationale scars, which are, you know, modern battle rifles. Oh, gosh. These poor hobbits. The bullets might be rubber. Or they might be some kind of, like... You know, lower velocity stun bullets. I'm not entirely sure because these hobbits are very, very good at just soaking up damage. So I think these guys might actually be more used. Oh, man. You, you got to watch out when the hayfields start speaking Vietnamese. But they, they, it seems to be more of a distractionary unit. And maybe they would work well with the lasso or the bedtime serum doctor to knock units out because bullets are not doing a very good job and then there's this guy look at that is that a fn a 57 i can't really tell whoa oh my god he's got a grenade okay so this guy just threw a grenade this is one of the four units that were in this like question mark question mark question mark and it looks like a regular grenade to me <laughs> oh my gosh it sent him flying okay hold on that hobbit is not going to Isengard. He just got launched off of the map. Now, does he use his pistol? Because it seems like his main weapon is that grenade. I wonder just... Oh, no. He fires the gun. The grenade just launched. We, we put it in slow motion. Whoa. That just detonated and destroyed him. Okay, maybe... I know what you're thinking. For the scientific method, we're gonna need more hobbits. So how about a conga line of hobbits? Because we need to see more about these grenades. Oh my goodness, look at that. Don't you love slow motion ragdoll physics? I mean, that's what Tabs is all about. Because ragdoll physics. <laughs> oh my god. I don't regret anything, okay? So, he's fired his pistol. Once again, these bullets must be deterrents. <laughs> these grenades are amazing. Because look at that. It can launch them, but there's no fire, really, other than the little explosion. But who are these guys? Why, why are you in my computer? Well, we've acquired a lot of, uh, let's call them scientific volunteers. Hey, Mr. Hobbit, while the time is frozen, wink at the camera if you're being held against your will. See? They're all volunteers! And we got the whole crew. We've got the guy with the big old stun grenade. We've got the doctors with the bedtime serum with these weird SCP badges. And then we got the lasso. So containment and securing functions. And then we've got the dudes who are there to distract by using these like rubber stun grenades. Yeah. Oh, no, you're not supposed to put your own soldier to sleep. Mr. Sleepy makes sleepy pants. So, I mean, this is a cool mod and all, but uh, it's nothing we haven't seen before. I'm not entirely sure why I had to put it. <laughs> Look at that grenade. Look at this guy. He's literally being carried off by the hobbits. Whoa, what? Hold on. That gun was firing. You saw that, right? That was super weird. Now I'm starting to wonder if this mod wasn't a Trojan horse to get into my computer and release something else because that gun just did something that i would call unnatural so i have an idea um i never really told you guys this but remember when cartoon cat and siren head infected my game that was on build i think it was 0.11.1 and now we're on 0.11.2 but since that we haven't encountered cartoon cat or siren head but if you go to the campaign for me and it was not on the exploding cacti, but it was this one, Fast Fire. This was the map where Siren Head first reared his Siren Head. <laughs> well, you can't have modded units in the campaign, unfortunately. There's not a, I wonder if there's a mod for that. So what I did was I did what worked last time, this spot. You I put archers on it, and uh, generally speaking, um, I put these guys in here, and it, it looks like a modern-day militia has just attacked the old western town, and, and I want to see if these guys are here to catch maybe Siren Head. Then again, the doctors had SCP on it, and Siren Head and Cartoon Cat, as you guys clearly told me, they were not SCPs. 
And they're just absolutely wrecking. Well, I, I wouldn't say wrecking per se. What? But nothing's really happening, so... I don't know. Okay, well, that didn't trigger anything. Maybe we need some of the doctors. I mean, but isn't that just weird? It's just, it's always squirting bedtime serum. And he hits a doctor with a lasso. But my thought is, maybe these guys are a hint. SCP doctors are around SCPs. I don't know. If we press play, does anything happen? Guess not. Why does nothing happen when I want it to? Oh, but I like the lasso. Look at this. Lasso versus the Western faction. Dude, he's able to get away from the lasso, though. That cactus boy is super strong, I guess. And those stun grenades are really where it's at. Where, sir, you just tried to lasso a building. I, I wouldn't advise that. Okay, well, uh, nothing really happened. Well, then let's at least have a little bit of fun. Let's see who is the best lassoer in the game. Mr. SCP Doctor or, you know, the old Wild Western dude on a, a very cool-looking pony. So... There you have it. It's just a bunch of weird units in the tabs. It doesn't... Okay. Hold on. Pause. We didn't hear any weird sound effect. This hasn't happened in a while. If the, the sun, sun stops... I'm a little confused. If the sun goes away, this is the time when Siren Head first... What's this, Shadow? This was the time when Siren Head appeared. And Cartoon Cat, but they both had like... Wait, hold on. Look. Over there. What is that? <sighs> it was here. It was right there. I'm sick of this trolling crap. Battle goes on and like, I, I just, I, it, it's frustrating to me when you try to look at something and it just disappears and you can't confirm or deny what it is. It's just gone. You want to look at it? It's gone. You want your game to work? It doesn't. You want people to hold syringes properly and stop squirting fluids everywhere? No, that's not how it works. And he's gonna get wrecked by a cactus because reasons. This is the crap you have to deal with when you put manila folder wrapped VHS tapes into your computer. It may seem like a good idea, but why is it never a good idea? What are these guys doing over here? They're chasing a cactus off the cliff? Oh my God, hold on. I never knew. Guys, did anyone, did I not know about this? Did I never know that there was a mine shaft back here? And they call it a mine? A mine! What's back there? Maybe that's where all of my... All the things that haunt me are coming from. I mean, Mr. Cactus. Let's do this, man. I can hear him. The soldiers are coming. Cactus man. Oh! We need a... We need a cannon. Oh, there's stuff back there. Like, you can see the bullets traveling a little bit. So, we found a weird mine shaft and... Oh, whoa, 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 The sun is changing again. Hold on. I gotta pause. This is the part where you gotta look around. And I'm gonna identify whatever it is. Whatever it is, I will find it. Okay, all the Gatling guns are coming over here. But I don't see anything else. I, I would imagine the rest of the battlefield has been cleared out. I remember when it was Siren Head. He first appeared over here as just a shadow. But the problem is when... When the sun goes away on this map specifically, everything looks like a shadow at a distance. So maybe I just need to reset the map. Hmm. All, all creepy, weird trolling stuff aside, I'm genuinely curious what's in this mine shaft. Okay, let's try to reset this because this guy just looks like he's taking a nap. All right, I took out the lassos on the Western Factions team. You know what? Can you put a sniper up here? I've always been kind of curious. That doesn't look like it'd be a very comfortable place to sit. What did, what did Landfall end up naming this town anyway? Oh, uh... Oh! First off, that was super weird, and then there's this guy just trolling around here. And see, that's a troll. Someone put something in the game and it laughs at you when you try to identify it. That is that is the definition of troll. I feel like this VHS tape had a virus in it or something. But that laughter was not as creepy as the cartoon cat laughter, that's for sure. Okay, come on. Come on, man. Come on. I want to know what it is. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. What? Whatever works. If it works, I want it. Okay. Okay, that's... That was super creepy. There he is. Wait a second. What is up with his chest? That's an SCP, right? Hold on. If I get too close, I think he'll go away. Uh, tall white torso. Uh, I'll stay away. I want to see what he does. He can barely walk. Oh God, he's he's destroying. Oh, he's attacking. Oh, he's teabagging that doctor. He's 
just eating them up. What are, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you do- Stop. Stop. What are you doing? Okay. Beetlejuice. <laughs> Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice. Come back. That's creepy laughter. That's the creepiest laughter and... Wait. Was that him? Oh, no. I think that was just a stun grenade going off. Okay. We need a- There he is! He's right in the middle of the battlefield! Alright. I can't pause it, because if we pause it and we get close, it disappears. I don't think it likes to be seen. I- I can't make out his face, though. I'm s- What are you th What is that thing? He just blocked a bullet?! How the heck do you do that?! His face looks a little bit different, but his arms are almost as long as his body. He's almost a <laughs> grenade to the face. He seems to be almost twice as tall as the average Tabs person. And he's only attacking the faction that has the soldiers and the doctors, which are, I guess, in the SCP employ. I think it's SCP-096. But he just looks different. He doesn't... And we haven't gotten to see him open his mouth, and that's usually the way you can tell for sure. Is... does SCP-096 cry? Oh my god, that is just... I am not... I do not feel comfortable listening to the sound effect at all. I mean, this is the creepiest stuff Duck ever. Duck. Ever since patch 0.11.1. What are you doing? You taking a nap? That... Uh, I need to know what you are. I need to know where you are in the computer. The files, man, the files are in the computer. Juice beetles, juice beetles, juice beetles. Okay, okay, that's, what? That's cartoon cat laughter. Oh, he just popped out and he's disappeared. Why, 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 why do you do this to me? It's not fair. You know what we need? We need Master Chief. I mean, Master Chief might be able to fight him, right? Um, I think the best way to fight these guys is, I, I think they, he would need to be stuck with a bedtime serum needle and then <laughs> riddled with bullets. Okay, we're ready. We're ready for you. You can come out now and we can kill you. See, no Master Chief's here and he's not coming out. Is it a he even? Or an it? A she? Or is it a sandwich? I mean, I... Oh my god, these poor cacti. They're getting wrecked. Uh, well, nothing happened. Hmm. All right, I've got an idea. He didn't come out... He, she, whatever. Didn't come out when Master Chief was here on the battlefield, but we can call Master Chief in from orbit. So as soon as it pops up its ugly little head, which I hate to look at, that's when we're gonna attack. So, okay. Drop pot! Okay, we pause time. Just to make sure. Master Chief just came in. This is- Whoa, they, whoa, whoa, whoa! He just appeared from the air! And he face planted into the dirt! Master Chief, which side are you on? Oh! How did- See? You don't even see it materialize. It literally just appears. It pops out. Look at this. This is probably the closest I've seen. And it looks like he's- What are you doing with your hands, bud? Okay, and you're gone. Do they even die? Huh. What do, you, what do we really think it even is? Huh? That's what we think it is. He only attacks one faction. In the past, Cartoon Cat and Siren Head would attack randomly. So, I don't understand the crying. Here we go. So, according to the SCP Wiki, the SCP Foundation, there he is. Look Look at his height. I'm gonna try to keep my distance so that he doesn't disappear. I've, that kind of how it works. Humanoid creature, check. Measuring 2.38 meters in height? Check. Very little muscle mass? Check. Uh, looks like he's suffering from mild malnutrition? Definitely check. Arms are grossly out of proportion with the rest of the subject's body? Oh my god, the lassos aren't working. Yeah, I'd say that's definitely true. He just... He's just destroying everything. And the lassos aren't working And Oh my god, I'm not sure what he was trying to do to that cactus. Uh, yeah. SCP-096? Isn't he nicknamed the Shy Guy? But the only Shy Guy I'm familiar with is the one from, like, Mario. Where he's, like, the little dude with the red red cloak and the, the funny little white mask. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. Uh, let me know if we should do more investigation. What kind of SCP soldiers I could ask to have, like, you know, to try to contain him? Because the lasso didn't work. The bedtime serum didn't work. The guns were woefully... Th those were... Must have been, like, light rubber rounds. They weren't actual bullets. But, I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm shutting the game down. 
Thanks for watching another episode of Tabs. Please help me figure out what's wrong with my game other than I put a VHS tape in it and I'll, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. By the way, if you guys stayed till the end, wish me a happy birthday. August 8th is my birthday, so thank you. Love you guys. See you in the next video.